Dixon, the inside ball. People's perception of me is that like I'm a loud mouth, cheeky, chappy, always energetic, always on the go, because I'm a rugby pitch. I have to like hit all these forwards, shout at them, and I'm quite an aggressive person, whereas as soon as I come off a pitch, I'm, I'm quite a quiet person that likes to, my own space, my own time. Um, this is my wife, uh, Becky. Hello. Uh, my oldest son, Joshua. Middle son, Oscar. And then in the little basket here is our youngest, who's three and a half weeks now, Charlie. And then Becky's mum, which we call Nonny. You know, rugby's quite a stressful game. Um, you know, you, you can get yourself worked up about it. You can get yourself, you have quite a few downs in rugby, you have quite a few ups. And, when you're down and you're a bit stressed about rugby, you come home and your whole life just changes because you've got your family and that's the most important thing for me, really. One of the good things about playing at Nahampton is it's very much a family club. Well, today's a, a day off for me. Um, just taking the kids to school, dropped them off, and now we're on the way to the club. This is the change room. Sorry guys, no access in here. So we're going to take Lee through um, basically one of his power sessions. So first of all, we'll take him through a warm up, which is really important. So we'll stretch and release the muscles, activate his hips um, and all over the body really, uh, raise his heart rate, and then we'll take him straight into his power session. You've got to be mentally strong as well as physically strong. You've got to be strict on what you do. That's from diet to the way you live. My top tip for someone trying to aspire to be a Lee Dixon would be um, his desire, dedication and hard work. Diet is massively important to especially someone like Lee. Um, and uh, we are fortunate to have a really good nutritionist here who works with the chef. After a session, you just see he's had a protein shake there, but which will have protein and carbs in. And then out of rugby, like that, I do like a, a nice big Chinesey. We've ran quite a lot, we've, we've burnt off a lot of energies in the game, so it's always nice to have a, a little cheat day. No such thing as a cheat day. <laughs> right guys, I'll take you to the match day changing room. Follow me. I always have a lion day of a game. Um, always have a shave and a shower, in that order and then go downstairs and I always have beans and sausage on toast. Come in and then I have, uh, I always take my left arm with tape and I write all my children's name on there and then just write a little message to myself about the game on the top of it, just the key points. The most difficult thing about the sport is the time you're away from your family. Family is probably the most important thing I'd say. <laughs> 